Yo, Shell Knuckles and Sharks. We're getting the Sharks. Is that Marine over here too? No, that's Black Rifle. Oh, that's Mad Minute. John. Bro. Why am I getting so many silver megaphones? Give me crystal ones. Hey guys, Ghost Boy Ghoul here. I will be pulling over 2,000 gacha tickets. Um, I'll have pulled it live on Twitch by the time you're watching this video. But uh, I'm just gonna chop up my Twitch recording of, of all my pulls here and uh, show it off on YouTube. Yeah, so this is the moment we've been waiting for. I've been mentioning this in previous videos for a long time now. This is almost a year coming. I think I've been saving gacha tickets. Um, well, most of my gacha tickets, at least, since, like, the, uh, killer attire, Matt's killer attire and Aerith's br bridal, um, dress. That was, like, November last year, November 2023. So, yeah, it's been almost a year of saving, um, lots of tickets. Pretty much the only ones I've been pulling is any overflow from 999 that goes into my mailbox. But uh, even then, I've got um, these to pull, too. I think I've got 176 gotcha tickets in here to pull, too. Um, they're going to expire soon. But yeah, uh, I'm going to chop this video up, use this part of the beginning, and uh, see you on the flip side. So let's start with this, you know. Obviously, I, I pulled all my free stuff like this and uh, pulled on a lot of banners, so... My weapons are already doing quite well, right? In this game, but... <clears throat> Alright, we're getting two five stars right at the gate. Let's go. Not even from ticket. Alright. A lot of things that already have it OB-10. So, like, I think Max Ray is probably OB-9 or 10 now. But this is definitely OB-10 already. Black Rifle. We're gonna try to get through them kind of quick because I think it's gonna take a couple hours, even if I was to go at them pretty quick. So, uh, here we go. Let's get at it. Oh, I got one other thing I can pull right now. Not mu nothing much, but let's, uh, let's pull these. Ah, some crystals. Nice. Okay. All right. I think we're, we should save, like, some of the five-star stuff for the end, you know? Uh, we'll work our way up. Let's start with the... Uh, almost 1,200 uh, regular gosh tickets. Let's get it. And, like, all the four-star stuff, even the one-star stuff, all the four-star stuff I'm gonna get is gonna get add up. Like, I'm gonna have a bunch of weapons just from parts. No doubt. No doubt. Hopefully I get a few of my, like, weapons I would normally wish list, you know? I'm, I'm sure I will. There's gonna be some good moments. There just, there has to be. The likeliness is there. I need a lot of Kate Tiff stuff, so I'm happy to see this. And my Zach's not that great, so... What am I getting here? Marching horn and uh, this arc sword that I'll never use. All right. <laughs> we'll get a lot of that. Let's get some newer stuff, man. That's, that's what I've been holding on, right? So... Oh, well, that's OB-10 now. I think it was sitting at OB-9 for quite a long time. Mythful Rod, OB-10, let's go. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> that's the worst pull I could get. Uh, here. I can turn my chatbot off just for this stream. There we go. Because I'm going to use this recording for YouTube, so. Alright. Okay. Ooh, I'm fast as fuck, let's go! 
What's up, homie Tata Bean? Hope you're doing well. <laughs> Peepo with the paper. I got you on Lurk over there. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll say it legitimately since I'm here. Since you're here. <laughs> appreciate you. I appreciate you, homie. Miss you, Tata. I gotta, I gotta come over there, uh, hang out with them in VC sometime. I'm slacking. I'm slacking on everybody. It's not just you guys. In real life, I'm, uh, I've been quite uh, the lone soldier lately. <laughs> Missy Tata. <clears throat> All right. Good luck in your game, Tata. See some five stars. Let's go. Big money, big money. Glenn, Lucia. I don't have this OB10 yet. What's that? HP and fire potency? Oh, and this is only like OB3, so. Now it's OB4. Let's get him. Snowflake, that's I think I have that it'll be seven, so that's it'll be eight now. That has high magic attack potency, that's gonna be nice to have. It's already better than like my OB10, like Absolute Royale and <sighs> Edged Wings for our ability, and, and even like base stats. It's sitting better, it's sitting prettier. I'm cool with these like four star ones too like I said it's gonna add up especially with all my four star gotcha pulls I'm gonna be doing after these two Ooh, baby I'm gonna have to go through all my weapon parts and just add them up stack them to the ceiling all right Get this. all right all right let's go Yeah, I definitely don't have uh, that anywhere near anything. <laughs> All my Kate, Kate Sith stuff's like under OB6, so I'm happy to get any of that. Or most of it. Raven, what's up, my dude? Oh, you got the wiggle too! Waddle! The waddle! <laughs> no cat, only Tifa. Yeah. <laughs> I got some, I got some, uh, Tifa emotes. No, no Kate Sith emotes, so no cat. R.I.P. <laughs> Vincent weapons will be nice, too. If I can pull any. Few bad pulls in a row. That will take a look. It's bound to happen. It's inevitable. I'd like to have all of Vincent's stuff at least OB6. That'd be nice. It's already pretty much there. There's a few sitting at like OB3 to 5 right now. I, was, I went pretty hard on the Red Crystal uh, Vincent pulls. Vincent drops is low, sadly. Uh, yeah, because his weapon pool is way less than everyone else's, right? I'll take any Vincent weapon ex except for Sheeran. I already have that at OB10, so. <sighs> I 
I'm sure we'll see something. We'll, we'll see a few, maybe. If I'm lucky, I guess. <laughs> so far, it's like, I'm getting some stuff, but it's not really, like, nothing amazing. Nothing really even new yet. My gold weapon count is gonna go right up, though. Woo! Three, that's nice! Very nice, Matt, Yuffie, Barrett. Let's see what we get. Okay, Slick Beetle, Arctic Star, and W Machine's already OB10, but I don't think the other, the other two are not. That's a nice one. Let's go! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about! Let's go! <laughs> Alright. Here, let me uh, do a little... Here, this is me. Uh, I don't drink anymore. I'm a, I'm a year and a half sober, but I was wasted in this clip here. Let's go! <laughs> oh wait, that's not the one. That's not, that's not the one. I guess I have two of them. I forgot. Okay, this is the one. Woo! Let's go! Oh, that's not it either. Ah, oh, whatever. I, I, I got one in there that's fucking whack. <laughs> Part of my language. <laughs> Where is it? I'll find it. Oh, Marisame outfit, that's nice. I'll try this one. <laughs> I feel like I gotta find that now that I explained it. Uh, Grand Gloves? I They're already OB10 for sure. I think they're OB10+. Plus. I use those all the time for uh, healing potency. They're nice. Purple Pain. I don't know why they changed the name of those gloves from Remake. They should keep the names. Purple Pain was a cool name. Good luck with my pulls, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, Faded. Farted. How's it going? It's going well, Matrix. Going well. Thanks for stopping by, my dude. We're doing over 2,000 gacha pulls here today. Big money, big money. Wish me luck. <laughs> we got some good stuff so far. I'm not a whole lot of luck, but you know, it, you're uh, it's, you're bound to get some things. And coming from an account that already has a lot of things, high overboost, it's like... A lot of, a lot of things that I'm gonna pull are gonna be uh, redundant. Ooh, Mursame outfit, let's go. Let's go. 2,000 of them, how long did it take you to save up that many? Since, uh... Somewhere in November last year, since Matt's killer attire and Aerith's bridal dress, like the magic wind... Arcanum outfit. I decided to start saving until Vincent came out, and then I saved a little longer. But yeah. Here we are. Oh, Vincent, let's go. Just don't be Shiron. Watch it be Shiron. Anything but Shiron, I'm happy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, this is his healing thing. That's the one I have the least amount of. I, ha I think I have that at, like, OB2. So that's, like, OB3 now. Yeah. Yeah, my leather gloves is, like, OB1. I never pull them. But, like, having those at OB6 would be nice, because they've come in clutch for so many people so many times now. <laughs> Save Lucia's tickets though. Her new weapon is pretty good for 3 HP. Good point. Yeah, I have like a little uh, list here. I am going to be saving uh, Lucia's, Aerith's, Vincent's, and Sephiroth's ticket for when their four weapons hit the pool. I'm guessing the next banners for anniversary are, are all going to be limited. So, like, there's, it's fine, you know? Like, I don't have to worry about those characters, weapons, entering a pool anytime soon. 
But yeah, I am gonna be saving those tickets. I don't. I think I have like one Sephiroth ticket, anyways. But yeah. True. <clears throat> I'm still I'm still pulling over 2,000 even without pulling these characters. But I bet um, Lucia's weapon does it get higher potency or higher um, debuff cap at OB6? I would assume it does. I feel like I checked and that it does, but I forget. And I like my Lucia. Lucia is one of my mains, so I did not pull on that banner, but. Uh, I'm sure I will be using that weapon. It's better than Barn Swallow for the Diamond Sigil, that's for sure. I feel like Barn Swallow will still get used in like a magic attack Tifa build, maybe. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. I, I give some weapons the benefit of the doubt, you know, like uh, try to see the bright side on every weapon. <laughs> Diamond Sigil and Effect, like Aerith Umbrella, yeah. So good, exactly. Magic and physical defense down. And for only 3 ATB, it's gonna be great. I feel like it's gonna be necessary for some battles, you know? Ah, that's already every 10, so that's an over-over boost. I still have over 700 of these. Plus whatever's in my, uh... Mailbox. Alright. I have a little bit of an unlucky streak here. What I'm gonna do, speaking of mailbox, while well, I am remembering it, so I don't forget, I'm gonna go pull my tickets from my mailbox, and then we're gonna go right back in there. I think I have enough to... Yeah, 174. Okay. I was off by two, I thought I had 176, but that's pretty well, pretty good. Pretty well, pretty good. <laughs> this is crazy, I'm actually pulling from here. It feels uh, so foreign to me. <laughs> did I do the Rama X co-op yet? I did, dude, it was way tough, way more tough than I thought it would be. Me and some of the boys uh, on the guild, um, Shout out to them. We we went at it, and I and I was like, oh my gosh. Okay, so I'll tell the quick story, I guess. I, I'm like, I had a long I had long shifts all week today because I'm like working extra hours for to make more money for Ever Crisis <laughs> for the anniversary coming up. So, anyways, I I had to work a long shift in the morning, so I'm in bed trying to sleep early, right? And I'm like, I keep my phone at the other end of my room, so I get out of bed and like, ah, I should check my. I like to check my phone and it was like 10 p.m. after the after the reset and an update happened in the game and I'm like ah oh. <laughs> I mean no, I'm not like ah oh, like a bad thing like ah oh, like okay cool I check it out we got Rama all the stuff is going on I check the discord people are like joining co-ops I'm like okay it's pretty tight right now you know everyone's having fun <laughs> here I am trying to sleep so I, I wanted to join the fun I wanted to join the fun Got a couple, a couple of the boys together, <laughs> and uh, came in clutch. Shout out to Wiki Bobo as Red Thirteen, B Cross Zero as Aerith, and uh, I was Glenn for Rama X Two. <laughs> and uh, no, but I didn't even get to like the most intense part of it. Like uh, I, I'm like super tired I'm like okay like we can do this let's let's run it we'll do it and I'm like assuming like okay we'll beat it in a few runs you know like half an hour at most we were at it for like four hours <laughs> like just trial and error like it felt like we knew what to do within like the first couple battles and then like it like there is always someone messing up me a few times too you know always someone messing up but we slowly inched our way to victory and the battle's so long, man. Like, Rama has so much health, and if you screw up, like, very minorly, like, you're just, you're dead. <laughs> it was wild. <laughs> yeah, I finished it last night. It was very difficult. Aerith and I had, had her umbrella from the guild exchange menu. Nice, dude. Yeah, I got, that's the only one I've um, bought a bunch of too. I bought one copy of everything from the guild exchange and I have that at OB7 now. 
of Aerith Umbrella. It's good for the magic defense all, right? And, uh... You know what? Now that you're mentioning that, I didn't even have that equipped yesterday. That, that would have helped. I probably could have put that on instead of, like, Leviathan Cutter. I'd like the magic defense and uh, lightning resistance from Leviathan Cutter. Probably could have given everybody some more magic defense there. Hmm. Ooh! Marine Shooter! And the... Okay, I think this is at OB9 now. I think I had an OB8, Silver Staff. That's nice to have. And this has been on my wish list. I think it's going to be sick for my uh, physical attack fire builds, whether it's going on Cloud or Sephiroth, uh, just on the back. I want that at OB10. Four hours? Maybe I'm exaggerating. Maybe it was like two and a half for three. Honestly, I wasn't counting, but I was so tired, it at least felt like four. <laughs> I don't know. I wasn't counting. <laughs> but, uh... But as a healer and debuffer, if I screwed up, somebody would die. It was a bit stressful, yeah. Dude, even as Glenn, like, if I did one extra Rising Strike when I should have been doing a Flooding Stream, like, Rama's meter wouldn't, would, like, be too far ahead and, uh, he'd kill us. Or... Oh, there was one moment, I remember, we were, like, halfway through the fight, and I forgot Rising Strike, like, needed a 50% HP threshold to get your Water Potency up. And Wiki Bobo and I were about to pop off uh, Leviathans on Rama, but I didn't have my water potency up. And Rama just broke into Sigil Phase. I think I had like 40% HP or something like that. And I tried to Rising Strike during Sigil Phase, and I didn't get my water potency, and I totally forgot that like I needed a threshold, and I'm like, what the heck, did it just glitch? Like, I don't know what I was thinking, but I was like, it was in the moment, like, fuck. I gotta do another Rising Strike, like, no, and then I, like, I do another one, and I still don't have the Water Potency, and it's during this, my second Rising Strike, I'm like, oh shit, the frickin' HP threshold, and then I'm seeing the Sigil Bar go, and I'm like, oh shit, I should be breaking Sigils, and then, like, he killed us, so, so that was one of my screw-ups, but, uh, <laughs> oh, man, so, yeah, I mean, happens to the best of us, I'm not saying I'm one of the best, I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I'm um, I'm just a whale with half a brain, man. I make a, I make a lot of mistakes. I'm not the smartest, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. Not the shiniest berry in the bush. All right. <laughs> I had quite a few screw ups as well. Oh man. Make it memorable. Ooh, was that double Kate Sith? I want some green. Um, okay, two of them that are actually on my wish list. Crystal Megaphone I want more of. It's sitting at OB5 right now for me. Floral Vase, I want more of. I want I want to get both those OB10. My floral vase is only OB3, I think. It's been on my wish list. I'm just not pulling them. And one more thing, not I don't want it as much as those two things, but I also want green megaphone. I think that'd be good to have just at OB10. It's got water potency and uh, magic attack. It'd be good on water, water Tifa as a sub weapon. Let's see what we get. Eh. Is that silver or crystal? I can never tell. Silver. Ah, oh. <laughs> that's okay. Hopefully, we see one of those three megaphones at some point. You know, we have all the character specifics too. We have all the four star tickets to go through. There's Crystal. You can't, I can't tell the difference between Silver and Crystal. Anyways. <clears throat> oh yeah, and then another thing with the uh, Rama X2 fight. Uh, we had to have Aerith pop off her um, her, like, healing limit. Not healing wind, but the newer one. The more recent one. Like, right after Rama does all the magic defense downs. And, uh, mistakes were made there a bunch of times. But we trucked through it. We got it. <laughs> that was another tough spot. 
Hey, working out. <laughs> we out here. We're getting jacked. <laughs> All right. Jacked up on Ever Crisis. Let's go. <clears throat> oh man, I'm gonna have so many weapon parts. It's gonna be like, I'm gonna be looking through my weapon parts as, and I'm gonna have copies of things that I don't even remember pulling, pulling, I'm sure. I'm sure a lot of my, like even before this pull video, a lot of my weapon parts are sitting over 100, you know? So, oh, was that Twinkling Star? I need those. That's nice. Mine's under OB5, I think. It's either OB3 or OB4. That's normal on for crisis. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Now it's all my oat food. Let's see what we got. Another twinkling star. Aura's ice one would be cool too. Oh, uh, ceremonial. I didn't pull on any of these Zach, Zach banners. I don't really mean Zach, but like all this stuff's gonna be good to have. <clears throat> All those are good. Any banner weapon that I don't have, I'll take it. But I don't have it, I'll be dead. My wish list lately has been red silver collar. I want more of those. Mine's like OB2, I think. Crystal megaphone, flower vase. Marine shooter, we got one of those. And, uh, it was Slay the Day for a bit, but I got a bunch of copies of it and I took it off for something else. I'm trying to remember what it was that I took it off for, but I'm sure if we pull it, I'll, I'll be happy, you know. I'll remember. Please don't forget to say hi to her. You know, it's a good idea. <clears throat> we need more, speaking of flamethrowers, mine's OB-10 already. But we need more magic attack fire weapons. Like, what's Tifa doing getting shell knuckles when it's level 120 OB10? It's sitting at like 31 magic attack. What the heck is that? Like, <laughs> we need like high magic attack our ability fire weapons. If I like use, um, I don't know, Zach's like uh, limit break fire weapon in main hand, it's so hard to hit max like magic attack with like high fire potency still. It's ridiculous. What rank did your guild finish at? Mine finished at 14th. Oh, you moved up. Nice. We're pretty happy with this, given that most of us are free to play. That's really good for, like, being mostly free to play. Congrats, dude. Uh, my guild finished in 7th. Final Fantasy 7, mother buzzard. Let's go. Finishing in 7th. I'm still stoked. I am still stoked. <clears throat> but yeah, congrats on 14th. That's huge. There was a huge battle going on between 10th and 11th. Um, I think it was Cosmo Canyon and Ultima. Ultima for sure, I'm not sure what Cosmo Canyon. But man, I think uh, one of them was in 10th for the longest time and like on the last day and then Ultima passed uh, Cosmo Canyon into 10th in like the last half hour, which was wild. I think that was pretty intense. Good for them. I post. I made a tweet on Twitter being like stoked in like the last hour and I showed like the top 10 teams and like never crisis for the win baby let's go sitting in seventh kind of thing and uh, in my screenshot the 10th place team ended up coming in 11th <laughs> so but yeah top 10 I don't think we'll ever reach top 10 hey you never know if you're hitting 14th like, maybe your guild is going to be, like, better with a specific element than the ones that have been so far. You might. Might be uh, neck and neck or even past us one day, you know? You never know. <sighs> Got some ads. Fair. That happens. I'll, uh, slow it down a little bit after this pull for you. Let let's see what happens here. We'll, we'll watch the Iron Giant for this pull, just for Matrix.
Oh, nice dodge. It's been so long since I actually watched this. <laughs> oh, Lee, that was a good one. Let's see a five star or five. <laughs> got one. We got one. Skip to win, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> That's his lightning potency one, right? I'll take it. I don't I don't really have many copies of that, Broadsword Axis. I think that's like OB4 or OB5 now. Well, we take those. <laughs> we'll watch the next one too. Just just because uh there's some people uh in ads right now. Took me like 30 or 40 minutes to do a thousand tickets. So without skip, that's like two hours. Holy moly. That's a lot. Yeah. It's gonna be a lot. That, that's why I figured, you know, I may as well stream it. I may as well hang out with some people, you know? While I do it. And I was like waiting the whole time. I'm like... Another fever, nice. I was like, had the intention over the months to make a, a YouTube video for these polls, but hey, like, why not stream at the same time? You get both, you know? Get to hang out with the community. And I'll just take this recording. Chop it up, chop it, skew it. Ooh, dude, enemy laundry. Yes, buddy. That's OB9 for it now. It was sitting at OB8 for a while. I'll take that. That's one we're gonna wanna make level 120 for the uh, attack potency over 30. Okay, you hear me now? All right, all right. We slowed it down a little bit during the ads for you, Matrix. We watched a couple of the Iron Giant uh, attack animations, which were both Dodge and Fever 7777, by the way. We're killing it out here. Vincent and Tifo. We got a Vincent. Let's see what we got. I want more of um the Thunder Gloves for Tifa too. Ooh, Feather Gloves? I think that's either OB9 or OB10 now. I think it's OB9 actually. And Quicksilver is now OB9 I think. It was at OB8 before. Okay, cool. That's good stuff. I'm hype. Feels like a job well done, you know? All the saving to finally get to use. Ooh, yes, buddy! Electro Cannon! That's OB1 now. We need more of those. We want that at least OB6. Let's go. Speaking of Electro Cannon, I think I have made my choice with the free uh, costume that we're going to get on the 6th. Or through events after the 6th. I think I'm going to get... Uh, Barrett's costume that came with the Electro Cannon. It's just HP 10 points, 10% in both magic and physical attack potency, and 20% in both magic and physical defense potency. It's just all around great for any battle. And I only use his fiery cape otherwise, so it's better than that. May as well upgrade. I don't miss a lot of what I, uh, that one or Yuffie Wind Arcanum, that's a good one to have too. The thing is, I have most of the Arcanums. One of the ones that I missed is Aerith, and I regretted missing it for a while. But, like, at this point, it's like... Aerith's almost never an attacker anyways. Even if she was going to be on a fire team, she'd probably be, be more of a healer or a support unit. So, do I really need Fire Arcanum Aerith? I don't know. Plus, I still don't even have a copy of her fire weapon. I think it's set, sitting at a uh, four-star. <laughs> Which, not many, uh, I don't have many uh, weapons sitting at 4 star. Before I pull, let's just look. But it's so, it is ugly, the classic Kony. I wouldn't actually wear it. I think I would, uh, I would use a skin. Better to go for Tifa. I have, I have all the Tifa stuff. I, I have, for sure. But I see what you're saying. Better to go for Tifa as in, like, use her shell knuckles and outfit. For sure. It's just like, Aerith will have her use, you know? Yeah, it's 4-star. 
it's freaking well not th this doesn't do that but it's aoe and then hits harder on a single target kind of like sephiroth's um limit break weapon oh wait this is level rarity there's all my four star weapons right there that's uh that's all I'm sitting on, sitting at four star. I I would have a good physical ice team though. I would have the limit break, um, ice cloud, Tifa, OB10, holiday gloves, and uh, I'd probably put Lucia or Yuffie for an ice debuff. Uh, like, otherwise, <clears throat> depending on the situation. Yeah, Shell Knuckles do more damage than Zackfire. True. True, even better. And for Magic Team, I do have the Limit Break Zack Fire. And we're, we want to work on Shell Knuckles. Let's see some Shell Knuckles in these pulls, right? That is something that I want, for sure. Plus, oh, this must be Syringe Rapier. We were just looking at my four star weapons, right? Nice. Holiday Gloves are OB10 plus 15 for you. Holy moly, bro. That's wild. My highest over over boost, I think, is, like from non event weapons, of course, is like plus 8 or plus 9 on a weapon I never wish listed once. It's like on, uh, on Glenn's Diamond Sigil weapon. Pulled it so many times I can't even name it, but that's because I never use it. <laughs> I actually use Matt Syringe rap Rapier quite a bit on my alt account. It's sitting at OB5 on my alt account, which is like a month old. <laughs> yeah, for Syringe on main account. <laughs> it's, it's, it would be nice to have, for sure. Comes in clutch on my other account. Alright, that is definitely... I think this is beyond OB10 now think. If it's not, it's either OB9 or OB10 now. It's been a while since I used it. The last time I used that weapon was against Shiva before Shiva came back with uh, tougher fights. Maybe I was using it on Bahamut too. At first. I think. Ooh, two? I have so many Sephiroth weapons at OB10. Let's see if... I, a Radiant Edge would be nice. I have it at OB9 right now. Oh, that, that's a... Uh, yeah, that's good. I'll take that. Spiral Shuriken. This is her physical ice attack, right? I'll take that. And this is probably OB7 now. I think this is either OB5 or OB6. Let's go. I want more centipedes. I, I, mine's uh, either OB0 or OB1. That'll be nice to have at OB6. Matt's been so necessary for a lot of fights, and my mat is just not all that great. That's why like, I was thinking about his um, medic outfit too, but apparently that's not in. You can't select that for uh, the gear coming up. I'd like to work on all the characters so that I uh, don't have a whole lot for. Nice! That's an OB6 now, which is going to be great with her monster outfit. Awesome. I'll take that. I'll take that. Stuff a roll. Oh, Radiant Edge. Now it's OB10. That was OB9 beforehand. Let's go. Alright. I'm stoked on that. I just hope to see no more of them at all. <laughs> we never get another one now. <laughs> Alright. 
Marisame outfit, let's go. Yuffie. Let's see if a pinwheel, maybe. I could use one of those. That's like OB10, like plus 5 or plus 6 now. And we probably won't need to do much physical wind stuff uh, anytime too soon. <laughs> Wanna bet on that? But the might might not need much physical wind stuff uh, anytime soon. Well, <laughs> want a bet? <laughs> I'm thinking about it. No. Uh, anybody know whether Typhoon or Titan comes first? I feel like Typhoon's been more talked about, so maybe that's coming out first. You know. But if like we if we get Titan, then yeah, we'll need some wind stuff. Watch Titan be weak to like more magic attack wind. That'd be something. And release, like, whenever he drops, release a character that does, like, some magic wind, because Aerith is pretty much redundant. <laughs> That's another thing we need more of, magic wind. We have one magic wind, so yeah. Yeah, yeah, we need more of those. Even if it's a mastery, you know? Even if it's just a mastery. Or like one of those split element outfits like Lucia and Red got. Fire and ice defense and attacks. Come on, give me some of these. Oh, I have 206 of these perks. Oh wait, that's because we pulled one earlier. <laughs> okay. I'm tripping. We're almost halfway through the normal gacha pulls. <laughs> almost halfway through, and it's been almost an hour. Mind you, there was like a, te a 10 minute startup and a few minor breaks, but. These are taking a while for sure. I feel like as an ice debu debuffer in an ice team, or physical ice team, I should say, my Lucia, I would use Lucia first and foremost, unless I get Yuffie's pinwheel and or uh, her physical ice weapon higher over boost, and then I would probably replace Lucia with Yuffie, I think. I do have Lucy, uh, Lucia's 15% Ice Potency buff uh, outfit to the Easter one. But maybe Lucia would still be better. I don't know. I don't know. Obviously, Zack's the way to go, but I don't have that outfit, and I'm not getting it anytime soon. Told you, imagine without Skip, right? <laughs> Watching every single one. Ugh. That'd be wild. Let's get some of those shark tor torpedoes. Let's just get lucky and just get a bunch of the new stuff. That's what we all want to see. It's crazy with the daily gacha pulls. It's like sometimes you just pull once and you're just like, oh, that was a great pull, you know? Like, <laughs> and now we get a thousand of them and you're like, ah, nothing, 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 nothing. Ah, uh, whatever, 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 whatever. No, we got some good ones. We got some good ones. We got some stuff that I would normally put on wish list, like flower vase and green shooter. And we're still going. We're starting at the bottom, don't forget. You know, we're gonna pull the better tickets as we go. Let's see us slay the day here. I need two more of those. Let's see us slay the day. That's the one. That's my most overboosted weapon. Rest in peace. That's the one I was saying that I have at like OB10 plus 8 or plus 9. Now it's plus 9 or plus 10. <sighs> Shark. Got like 3. Knuckles 2. Moogle 2. Lucia like 3. So they're in the pool. They're there. <laughs> Did you pull a bunch too? Did you have a bunch of tickets saved up? I would have liked to wait for Hunan and Moonin and Citric Wand and all of them to hit the pool. 
would have been nice if they hit the pool with all this stuff. But you know what? With anniversary coming around the corner and dropping like somewhere between 600 and 1,000 bucks coming up, like, I think it's going to be nice to know uh, the wish list, you know? That was your logic as well, right? Yeah, it's just going to be nice to know what you should pull more of by then. And I figure pulling whatever I can now, you might get lucky and uh, check off some of those weapons we already have in the wish list right now. Because we're going to be able to wish list tune in and moon and all, and all that stuff soon. It's a shame all Vincent's weapons have like such horrible R ability potencies. Like, they're all so low. They're all great weapons, but like... As sub weapons, not so much. Like I wish, like, Kunin and Moonin was at least high potency in one or the other, because it's. I feel like for magic attack and magic ability stance potency weapons, like that's not gonna get used. I'm still gonna use my level 120 Obi-10 Umbrella over Kunin and Moonin. I'm still. Go I'm gonna use Flower Phase when I get more copies of that. I'm trying to. I'm trying to pump more copies of that. And like, Kunin and Moonin is just uh outclassed in our abilities. So basically I'm wishlisting it for one purpose only and that's for use and that it's not even gonna get used that often I don't think. But I still want it. I got Vincent's outfit. I wanna it's basically the equivalent or the counterpart to Tifa's guide gloves. But it's like speaking of Vincent weapons not that it'll be here in a moon but Pulling tack tickets now is also good to filter wishlist for anniversary pools. Because you know we are pulling deep on it. Exactly. Exactly, man. <clears throat> That's what's up. Quicksilver is now OB10. Let's go. Slick Beetle, we got a couple copies of that now. Oh, I still have all my four-star tickets too, dudes. I'm gonna even if Heavens forbid this happens, but even if it does, even if I get no five-star weapons out of all the four-star pulls, I have like 650-something-ish four-star gacha tickets. Like, we're going to be getting weapons just from parts. Like, a bunch of them. I'm pumped for that. <clears throat> uh, do, yeah. Enter Pokey Start. And then it'll give you a random starter Pokemon. A anybody who's lurking in the chat should do that. <laughs> Once you pokey start, any Twitch streamer that you're lurking in, you get like pokey currency and all that stuff just from watching them. And like your game carries over to any Twitch streamer who plays that game. Return to Monkey. <laughs> yeah. Now that your Pokey started, you can uh, Pokey catch. But you might have to do Pokey shop. Pokey shop five Pokey ball. You might have to do something like this, too. I can't buy that item. Why? <laughs> Did I spell Pokey ball wrong? Poke ball. No problem. Is that silver? Oh, I wish it was silver. Hand towards Z. Yo, you caught the A-Palm. Let's go. <laughs> All you need. Some people in the PCG community, the Pokemon community game community, like just go for specific Pokemon. Like you just go for your favorite one or one, you know. How <clears throat> I have no Pokeballs. I, I think you start with five, maybe. You probably start with five. And I think how it works for gaining Poke currency in someone's stream, if you're lurking and you have to send at least one message every 15 minutes, and then you'll get you'll get currency. Pretty sure that's how it works. Not saying you have to do that. I'm just saying that's how it works.
I want a couple more copies of... I think I only need, like, one or two more copies of, uh... I'm trying to remember the name of it. Serpent? Yuffie's Poison, uh... Shuriken. I want that sitting at level 120. OB-10. For her second hand, instead of, like, always using, um... Magic Shuriken when, like, you don't need wind. You know? Twin Viper! Thank you! Yeah! I want that OB-10, too. Glenn, let's see a side of the day, boy! Let's see it! You know you want to give it to me? Ah! Uh, that weapon looks cool, at least. But it's garbage. Okay, 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 okay. We we know that the um the the new anniversary weapons they're gonna be limited, right? I feel like of course they are, but like I don't know for sure, right? Does anybody know for sure? Uh, Lucia, Eris. What do we get? What do we get? I'll take the tranquilizer guns. Those are alright. I already have uh, enough uh, sun umbrellas. Also, we already seen Cloud's new Bahamut outfit. Everyone's getting Bahamut gear. We already got Bahamut gear. Well, Bahamut gloves, Bahamut rapier, you know. Notice, notice did say they will be available in certain banners. Ah, interesting. Maybe it's, maybe it's limit break banners, like Vincent's and stuff. Ooh, another Slay the Day? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Four of us pulls, I forget. It'd be nice if, like, all four of them are limit break banners, one of them being physical, and at least two of the other ones being the other elements that haven't been used yet. I really want to see Yuffie get a physical lightning weapon. Even if it's like a freaking uh, physical lightning limit break attack potency, you know? That'd be nice. That'd be cool. Speaking of Yuffie... I just want Tifa gear, man. What's she... <laughs> yeah, like... She's got the Bahamut Gloves, which out of like the free event, no, not even, it's not even event weapon, the free summon weapons, that's like one of the most usable, usable ones, you know? Pretty handy. Ooh, a pinwheel. I want those. We'll take those. That's an OB6 now, I think. Or OB7, maybe. I haven't missed a Tifa outfit. I've gotten every single Tifa costume. The one that I like, the, f the one that came with feather gloves, it, like for, uh, and it gives like stat buff duration or whatever, or buff duration. I feel like that's like the most useless one so far. Obviously you need buff duration on certain things, but I used it in like that event because it gave like the event bonus or whatever, and I don't. I feel like I'll never really need to use it. Something else will always be better than it. But I still got it. Bahamut gloves, and I saw that outfit like because it, it was like on one of the Japanese directs before the game released. It showed that outfit and a few other ones, but I knew that was coming for a long time. I just didn't know what it would do. Bahamut gloves is the only summon weapon I have level one. That's what I mean, like, I always, like, I never want to spend Mithril Aura on free, like, sum summoner event weapons, but I've been thinking about making that level 110, because that one, like, with the, uh, what is it, magic defense, and, uh, something else that's pretty good. Magic defense and HP or something like that? Either way, it's good, and it's, like, high potency in one of them, and, uh, I think it would be, it would be worth it. I feel like you made a good choice doing that. 
You know, Mithril Ore is pretty easy to come by now. It's getting easier, especially with guilds and the Crystal Cactars. That's something I'm excited for too, for Never Crisis. Once we hit level 50 battle, that's when I'm going to start the grind. That's when I'm going to start my, uh, getting Rama from level 8 to level 10, and, uh, co-op grinds. Actually, co-op grinds kind of have to come up this weekend, or within the next week or so, right? Because that's when we have them, for Leviathan and Rama at least. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I'll have to second guess that thought. Level 45 battle for Crystal Cactar still isn't too bad. Still isn't bad at all. I think that's where we're at right now. Oh my gosh. Whole lot of nothing for a little bit. Sheesh. Only another 300 neutral tickets. Junk or gold? Gold. It's so hard to tell the difference between some of these. Get out of here, Sheerons! I don't want any of those. I don't need those. I already got an Obi-10. Ooh, what a rough pull. Bunch of rough pulls. Bunch of rough pulls. Now the question is, is do I save up 999 plus again and wait for... Sid, and then his first banner weapon to hit the pool. I think that's that was my original intent. After I pull everything, I'm gonna save up again. But I almost feel like I can just pull, pull everything as they come in, as it comes in. You know, we're at a point in the game where everything's pretty strong. But no matter what, things are always gonna be better with power creeping, right? So maybe I will save. I think I'm gonna keep my word on that. You know? Hmm. You should save again? Yeah. For sure. I like Sid as a character too. Not as much as Vincent, but like in the original game, like I I liked him. Like my first time beating the game I brought Sid to the end. Fight Sephiroth, you know? I don't like him as much as Vincent, but I think I'm still gonna like go hard on him when he comes out, like I did Vincent. Maybe not as hard but pretty hard. Oh, is this the shark? Let's get it! Let's go! We want those! 3 ATB debuffer? Let's go! Nice! We want some more of those. We still got a bunch of the character specifics too. We'll see, we'll see what happens. At the end of all my pulls, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna look through all my weapon parts. I'm gonna go to weapons and just see what I got for everybody, you know, and go one by one to each character, over boost them all. Something else I'm gonna do uh, for YouTube. One of my most popular videos that I made was at six months in, I did like an hour long just account review. I just showed everything I had on my account talked about it on YouTube and uh, that was one of my most popular videos I think I'm gonna do the same thing at one year coming up soon just like one year account review and go over everything it's gonna look pretty darn good after all these pulls too it already looks pretty good so and those those types of videos are always fun to look back on years later when like the game's not a thing anymore 
I like doing that on YouTube, going back and looking at old games I used to play that you can't play anymore. What are we getting? More pinwheels? Yes! I want, like, I want a good ice Yuffie. She just doesn't have an outfit for it yet, you know? But, uh, I want her physical ice weapon and her pinwheel, so both at OB10. That'd be nice to have. If they're both OB10, I could see it arguably, arguably being better than Lucia with her Easter outfit and bald eagle and main hand. You know, as a debuffer. Because hitting with her ice weapon at OB10 at 3 ice debuff is going to be better than Lucia hitting with a uh, 5 star um, ice materia. Ooh. I think that is OB8 now. It was at OB7. It was either at OB7 or OB8 before. So it's either OB8 or OB9 now. I want a couple more of those too. That'll be nice to have. I think that has um, extra high fire potency. I'm gonna sell my outfit, let's go! One. Lucia. Lucia, Lucia. What did we get? Oh, black rifle. Matin red. Wait, Matt. I was looking at my other screen. I have three monitors, by the way. What did we get? Matin red. Was it that? Was that this or? Oh, that's nice. I think that'll be OB7 now. And Matt. Oh wait, that's Twinkling Star. That's Zach. Oh, Zach and red. Okay. Okay. Sure. We'll take him. Alright, sorry for the little lag there. Whenever I click off the screen, it doesn't continue with Ever Crisis for a minute. I, uh... <clears throat> Just made Raven a VIP. A any of the guild members, if they have Twitch and they come through the chat, I'll, I'll make them VIP. Anybody in the guild. Because I've, I've already been talking to you guys for months on Discord, you know? I know all y'all. <clears throat> Ooh! Buddy, three? Let's see a slay the day for Glenn. Ah, <laughs> rest in peace. I have enough of those. Uh, this is a uh, OB10 plus one now. I spent a lot of, I think I spent like four exchange tickets on this uh, in the first guild battle when I was still part of Ultra Crisis. For, uh, air, for Vincent's sub weapon because it has high earth potency. It's actually great as a uh, for its R ability. Tower Souls now will be ten. That was will be nine before. Awesome. <clears throat> hey, <laughs> dolphin cry. <laughs>
How many parts do I have for this? 57? Not too bad. Wouldn't blow Barrett parts on it or anything. Uh, there's so many times I used, like, not like a whole 200 or anything, but like to top off a weapon with um, character specific parts that wasn't limited. And it wasn't until the second rerun of, like, Limit Break Banners that I realized, I'm like, why have I ever, unless it was like less than 10, just to, like top something off to get another copy of it, like, why would I ever use all these character specific weapon parts on free to play weapons? Like, not free. Well, you know what I mean. Like, I'm spending like a little over 90 bucks Canadian on weapon parts packs for everybody all the time. Like, and I'm just blowing them on weapons <laughs> that uh, aren't limited. Ridiculous. From now on, only limited weapons is what what gets them. I might use like less than 10 or something to top it off, but other than that. Oh, this is something else I want more of, too. Mine's OB3 right now. Man, all these pulls, man. Get my arms tired, man. Getting my workout in. It's pull day, you know? Gotta do push day next. Ugh. Blue microphone. We can we can do without those. Getting my workout in. All these pulls. Best game workout. Watch out, ladies! <laughs> I did over two thousand pulls today. <laughs> I got. <laughs> Gonna save save the some ladies for the rest of y'all, you know. <laughs> uh, hilarious. Cracking myself up. Shouldn't quit my day job. <laughs> you don't have to say what you pulled, <laughs> right? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Should have seen me yesterday, girl. Over 2,000 pulls. <laughs> Most ridiculously stupid thing. Reminds me of uh, Anchorman. Sculpt my guns at the gym. You wouldn't believe how many reps I did. <laughs> Haven't seen a good five star weapon in a little bit, feels like, you know? It feels like it's been a bit. I feel like uh, it's time is due for for a nice wanted five star weapon. Before before these gotcha pulls are over, let's see if we get one more, you know? 63 of these tickets left. Let's see. Uh, Floral wand? I could use two more copies, I think. I think I can use that. I think mine's OB6 or OB7. That's not too bad. I have enough magic attack, um, lightning potency, our ability combo weapons, so. though. I've got, um. Is it called Bald Eagle? No, that's the ice debuff one. The one that does magic attack down that's lightning with high magic attack potency for Lucy, I have that maxed out. I've got Kieran Gloves maxed out. I've got CC Alloy maxed out. I got enough magic attack lights. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Did I get something I missed there? Did I get a, did I did I get an enemy launcher or something? I don't know. 
We'll, we'll see at the end no matter what, you know, but uh Green is green green's the water one, right? Yeah, I I think it is. That's good. I want those. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I'm happy with that. That counts. If the, if I missed an enemy launcher or something cool like that happened on a previous poll, that should count too, but I'm happy with the green megaphone. That's something I would eventually wish list for Kate if if, uh, if it came down to it, I think. I want those too. Speaking of like the ice euphemium trying to build. Dude, we're building her. Let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> I'm probably going to get all four of the anniversary outfits. And probably at least two of the outfits, I mean two of the weapons straight to OB-10. And the other two maybe OB-6. We'll see, you know, all that could change depending on uh, what they are and everything, right? But I think at that, oh, oh, I can be like, okay, I'm happy with that, you know? Need two more ice shurikens. You'll get it, you'll get it, we'll, we're getting there. Building up a nice ICU fee. Like I said, I feel like the ICU fee uh, would be a better debuffer than uh, Lucia. Not including Zach. Not including Zach the debuffer. I don't even have Pressure Ridge OB0 yet, and I don't have the outfit either. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Moving on. We move on to character specifics or four stars. Let's move on to character specific, um, non five stars. And I gotta refer to my note to make sure I don't pull Sephiroths, Vincent's, Aerith's, or Lucia's. So let's do clouds. Here we go. Cloud weapons. What would I even want? Cloud hasn't had a non limited banner since fire, since uh, the Chinese New Year. Right? Or... I think it was Chinese in here. It's ridiculous. Like, he just keeps getting the limited banners. He needs more... Th he needs more good weapons that you should just be able to pull off gotcha. But this is good already. Let's see what happens. Okay. It's magic attack one, and, uh... Yeah. But he gets all the limited ones, right? Ridiculous. You'd think Cloud would be more popular on the banner. He's the main character. I want to see Cloud on more on more regular banners. I don't main Cloud at all. <laughs> it gives me a reason to skip more. But I want to see him and get more attention. He should. That's OB7 now. I mean, all the girls, Sephiroth, and Vincent. And then, like, it's good to have, like, all the utility for Red and Barret and at, like, at least OB6 and stuff, I think. And I, I'm probably going to use Sid quite a bit when he comes up, too. And I would totally use Genesis if, if we get, or a young Genesis and young Angeal. Like, I would probably use, uh, go hard on a Genesis or a young Genesis as well. I feel like that wouldn't happen for a long time if it ever does, though. You hate Cloud. Give him nothing. <laughs> Dude, I actually want them to give more attention to the characters I don't use. Or don't use as often. So that I can skip more. <laughs> so that I can save more crystals for free. Free crystal. I wish all the characters I liked weren't as popular. But they're all so popular. <laughs> I'm still going to play the game every day regardless, you know what I mean, so. Alright. <laughs> A 
20 klar, 20 klar. Speaking of clouds, you know what was a good, good RPG on PS2 back in the day? Dark Cloud and Dark Cloud 2. Those were great games in my childhood. Building the villi building the villages in between each uh, dungeon, set of dungeons and stuff. Randomized dungeons. Those games were the shit. I think most people who played those games played more of Dark Cloud 1, which I played too. But I played more of Dark Cloud 2, personally. So those were great games. Anyways. That was a tangent. I want a Dark Cloud 3. Dark Cloud 3 would be sick. Bring it out, PS5. See it happen. Getting lots of 5 stars for Cloud. Not that, like, anything is really that good on him. I guess a, an Apocalypse would be nice. You know, some Apocalypse would be cool. But, uh... None of that, I guess. I saw your sister play one and two, they were fun. Yeah, dude, they're great games, man. And the crafting system and like a weapon improvements and shit in those games, it was like pretty, uh, pretty intense. Like, it got pretty deep. At one point, I remember I had like, I was stuck because I couldn't get certain uh, parts from certain enemies to uh, improve my weapons. And my buddy came over with his uh, action replay back on PS2 and he like gave me some cheats <laughs> and I like upgraded my weapons to the max and then like I just continued the game and I, I got to like the final boss and then I was still like stuck on I don't think I ever beat the final boss even with all the cheats that I got I don't think I ever actually beat Dark Cloud 2 I got to the final boss and then I just hung out there <laughs> for like ever but uh never actually beat it even with the cheats. What a noob. Alright. Barrett is safe to pull on. Let's do it. Only 10? Okay. Let's see a shark. Let's see a shark. Persian. We use the game fat guide to farm and for the weapon grind. Nice. Nice. The game fat. Game facts for the shit, man. All the physical guides back then. They're awesome. 350 perks. That's nice. I'm only 50 perks away from ob it, I think. That's nice. I know I used a physical... Th some physical guides for some games. I think Bre like a pretty old one. Breath of Fire 2 on Super Nintendo I had a physical guide for in the game that I used. That was sick. Th that was a great game too. That was a different era. So. I was, uh... I played that on like the Wii Virtual Console. Yeah. Good game. Classic RPGs. And then 10 magazines for Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Freaking Water Temple. Dude, I got, I'm one of those who got stuck in the Water Temple too because all the keys were like in like uh, hard to reach places kind of, well not hard to reach places, but it was easy to like lock yourself out of a room and like, I guess it was still possible to go around like the whole temple and get into another room and get the key. But it, well, it was really easy to get yourself uh, locked out and stuck in that temple. I actually, because of that, I think, uh, I never beat the original Water Temple until years later, until like, maybe like four or five years ago. But, I got stuck in the Water Temple, never beat it, and then on GameCube, I got Ocarina of Time and Ocarina of Time Master's Quest, which Master Master's Quest was sick, but I ended up beating Master's Quest before I beat the original. I did go back and end up, ended up beating the original, but, Master's Quest was cool, man, it, uh... You couldn't, there was no hearts anywhere, so you had to have potions or fairies. And everything was flipped. Everything was like mirrored. And all the temples were bigger, harder temples. 
But the water, because of that, the water temple was different and it was not the same water temple as the other one and therefore was a little bit easier, even though it was supposed to be harder. But yeah, I ended up beating that game before I beat the original. <clears throat> And lots of lots of lots of five stars out of the character specifics. Let's go. Oh, we just got the OB10. Now that's it. <laughs> uh, we already ha we got that OB10 a few pulls ago. <laughs> I guess we take what we get, you know. Take what we get. But yeah, I'm one of those one of those poor kids that got stuck in the water temple, man. And as a kid around that same era that I got stuck in the water temple, I watched my older cousin beat the game, like beat the final Ganon. So I knew I knew that. That was all stuck in my head, like nostalgic for years. But between the water temple and uh, the final battle, I didn't actually get to play through until years later. Although I did it on Master Quest. All right. We want to see more of these crystal gloves. I, I'm liking this. That's at OB7 now. I want that at OB10. Because Power Soul was in her second hand because it was OB10 for a while. But I feel like crystal gloves are going to be better with the Kieran gloves combo. The lightning potency, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I want to see more crystal gloves. These pulls are pretty good. But, like, where's all the shell knuckles? Let's see some of these. Let's see some of these. Come on. Me too, until the magazine got you through it. <laughs> got you through it. Yeah. <laughs> I was a, a Nintendo Power subscriber. I got all the Nintendo Powers and Game Pros. I got all the Game Pros, too. And one that was really cool that I didn't get, but my friend got, was the PlayStation Magazine Monthly or whatever it was called. I might be saying that wrong. But they were cool because they used to come with demo discs on PS1 and PS2. Demo discs were the shit, you know? Play games like before they come out or a little bit before they come out and you play through like a chapter of them. It's like we kind of got that like with virtual shit now. But. Th that was a different era, you know? Having those physically, that was pretty sick. And my my buddy uh, on PS1 had like this demo disc with like Medieval and one of the Spyros on it. And we used to play the shit out of that demo. Those demos. <laughs> this was when we were a kid. So you took all the shell knuckles from the bowl. Clearly, I didn't get one, like, five-star copy at least. That's what I was hoping for. That's what I was waiting for. Well, it's fine. Okay, we're saving in Aerith for uh, Citric Wand. That's something we're going to want to have at OB6. So we're going to save that. Reds we can pull. Let's see some Ivy and sil especially Silver Colors. I want to see Silver Colors. Some Ivies would be nice too. Let's see 10 Silver Colors. <laughs> that would be ridiculous. I'll take the 4 stars. They're going to add up. After the character specifics, we're pulling the four stars. That's gonna take a while too. We're not getting much red stuff, are we? Come on, at least one silver color. Come on. Or ivy color, I guess. Preferably silver. Come on. Five star. That's at OB8 now. Seaside. I knew what it was. Forgot what it was called. <laughs> It's like the one color you can differentiate. 
Other than if it's silver or gold. But even the gold one looks like junk. Silver looks like platinum. Or rubber. Speaking of rubber. That's leather. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know. Lies. No color can be identified. Yeah. <laughs> For real, though. Like, who am I kidding trying to, like, say I can... <laughs> see through this shit. Oh, we got 155 Yuffie wants to pull. And we can pull on Yuffie. Let's go. Oh, yeah. She's got the Bowies in here, too, right? We can get, uh... Striped Moogle Float. Let's get some of those. I only have that at OB0. And I have her fire arc in a mouth fit. I got it. I just... <clears throat> Let's go. Woo! It's a good start. Let's see what we get. That's... That's nice! That's very nice. This is OB7 now. Diner tray. We're getting some ten, ten, tens of these already. And that's like OB4, OB5 now. I don't know. Oh, I got three copies of them so far. That might be uh, OB6. Is there OB5 or OB6? Let's go. And that's a good one to have for its our abilities too. The Arctic Star. For sure. That pull was rough. Rough, man. You see? Crystal Cross. That's the magic attack up one, right? I think. That's probably OB8 now, I think. We'll take anything we don't have OB10. Anything that's actually usable. <laughs> that's usable. That's OB10 now. Four point shuriken. I think that was sitting at OB9 now. Oh! Maybe I had a copy and I didn't boost it. And I just didn't realize. Ugh. Well, like... Or did I just get... Oh, I got two of them. I got two of them. Yeah, that's what it was. Because there was two UP weapons. Cool. I'll be 10 plus 1. I'll be 10 plus 1 it is. That's a good one for our ability to do HP and buff extension. Four point shuriken. Okay. More um, over over boost for the earth one. So that's another good one to have, not just for the R abilities, but she's got an Earth Arcanum outfit too. Even though it's physical uh, ability potency, it still works for the uh, AoE Magic Earth. It's nice to have. We're getting lucky with the Earths. I mean, with the uh, Yuffies. We're getting lucky here. This is good stuff. Let's go! Okay! Obi-Wan, we want those. More pinwheels, dude, and I could use the pinwheels. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this is great. I'm happy with that pull. I saw my outfit. You see. Let's see what you bring to the table. More pinwheels. Holy moly, is this like a pinwheel fest? Like, at least it's not a... Uh... I think that's got to be getting close to OB10 if it isn't already now. Got to be. Nice if you pulls, definitely. My, I think my pinwheel was OB4 or I think it was actually OB5. I think it was OB5 before these pulls. That, so that's, it's getting close to OB10. Arctic Star, dude, beautiful Yuffie pulls, bro. I'm getting like all things that I didn't have as OB10 except for the one, uh, extra four point shuriken which was sitting at OB9 before which is fine and I still have a bunch to go dude these are even if I got nothing else from here on out but hopefully that doesn't happen I'm super satisfied with my UP pulls 
since I said that, it's gonna give me a bunch of junk now. <laughs> oh, great, you peoples. Let's see a Twin Viper, too. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Bunch of Garbo. I guess it, I guess I did get a few extra of these, but like I think I pulled one or two of them, or maybe just one in the regular gotcha pulls. I have over 80 gold to, <laughs> golds to pull. I'm gonna get so many things that are just absolutely redundant. I bet things I already have maxed. Streamer curse. Caster curse? It's supposed to be streamer luck. <laughs> That's why I'm doing this. <laughs> Let's see what happens. We'll see what happens. Now these have been pretty good. Pretty good. Clicking off the screen for a second here. Oh yeah, okay, here it is. I do still have the uh, the drunken the drunken me voice alert. Dude, I forgot about Hawkeye. We want those. I have enough of these, but this is how I'm feeling. Right now. Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Yeah, that was uh, that was a little much. <laughs> that was so fucking drunk in that clip on voice chat with some friends playing a game. Gosh darn it! Over the top. Those were the days. Let's go! Oh, yes, buddy! We're getting them! Oh, this is great! This is great! Dude, what amazing Yuffie pulls! Great Yuffie pulls! Excellent! <laughs> yeah, buddy! <laughs> All this talking's getting me dehydrated. Luckily, I uh, stocked up on hydration. <laughs> All right, where are we at here? I drop my list. Oh no, it's right here. I can't pull Sephiroth, I can't pull Vincent, I can't pull Aerith, I can't pull Lucia. So no Aerith. I can pull Gate Sifts. 40 of them. Let's see Flower Vaws, Crystal Megaphone, Green Megaphone. Let's see one of each. And 40 pulls. How beautiful, how beautiful would that be? Beautiful. Call what you want, get what you want. Be one of them, be one of them, be one of them. Not the one I wanted. Not the one I wanted. Oh. Aluminum tin microphone. <laughs> Paper microphone. What the heck was that? <laughs> Get out of here. I don't want to see those. What is this? The uh, weapon parts daily request? Get out of here. 
Fuck, got a crystal cactar and a first clear? No! <laughs> uh, bro, I want to buy the uh, the weekly pass. The $10 weekly pass to increase odds. From, like, whenever you, like, triple your stamina use, you get more. I haven't bought that since they increased the stamina um, for, like usage from times three to times nine. I haven't gotten that past. And I think it was Lyle in the in the guild discord showing how much mithril ore he was getting from uh, Crystal Cactar. And I was like, oh my gosh. And he's like, yeah, but it's like times 12 because of the past. I'm like, true, dude. Like, whenever I go, whenever we hit level 50 battle and I'm going in summon grinds, I'm buying that pass. Like, Whenever I'm gonna grind like that for the next week straight or so, you know? That's gonna be handy. I mean, crystal, silver. Get out of here, silver. I want crystal. Gosh darn it. We got a bunch of Garbo for Kate then. At least we got some five stars, but most of Garbo. Okay. No Sephiroth, no Vincent, no Aerith, no Lucia. We can pull Zach. And Matt left. 105 for Zach. Let's go. Let's get some. Let's get some good. Yeah, if you're gonna do grind, it's sweet. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna get that when I'm ready to grind. Type OO. We'll take that. That's OB8, I think, now. Got a bunch of Zach pulls to do. I'd like to see um, Crystal Sword Z, the fire attack one. I'd like to see a couple copies of that. Not too many. I think I only need two more. And like any of his newer ish or banner ones, like Twinkling Star, Ceremonial, Pressure Ridge, I guess. Need to head out. It's getting late. Best of luck. Lux. Yo, thanks for stopping by, dude. Sorry you didn't get to catch the five stars, but uh, maybe we'll get some clips and throw them in the Discord. Uh, I'll make a YouTube video out of it. I appreciate you hanging out. Have a good night, my dude. Cheers. <laughs> have, have good looks. Make sure to keep your eyes open. <laughs> English is hard, man. Hardest language out there. <laughs> Cheers, homie. This is insane. This is insane, all these pulls. getting much for Zach, okay? Had a lot of his tickets, too. Was pretty lucky with Tifa. Super lucky with Yuffie. Got a bunch of the striped Moogle floats. Very nice. There we go, there's Zach's lock. Let me let's see what we get with him. Uh Twinkling Star, good. Typo O. 
Or type 99, I mean. We don't need our... But the, those two are good. Two of three, that's not bad. A good Twinkling Star as a second uh, weapon in hand for him is going to replace the Type 99. I feel like Type 99 has been my second hand sword for a lot of his physical builds. But, uh, that's pretty budget. Like, my Zack is pretty bad. Pretty newbie Zack. A good Twinkling Star will, will take over for sure. And there goes that battle. Okay. Now we got Matt left. Left. Eighty-five for Matt. Then we do four stars. Then we do five stars. Let's see syringe rapier. Let's see centipede. Killer hornet. I already have a B10. Don't need those. <clears throat> nah, nothing there. What are we getting here? Uh, Stingray? That one? Okay, okay. I don't even know what that one's at. It's probably like OB4 or 5 or 6. If it was at OB6, it's at OB7 now. Matt? Go. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Healing showers. Prime number. We'll take them. We'll take them. I don't think mine's even OB6 yet. So. My mat's pretty rough too. But these pulls are helping out, that's for sure. More Stingray. OB8 at max potential for what it could be. It's either OB6 to OB8 now. So we got two. Let's see some syringe rapiers and centipedes. Centipedes especially. That's what I want to see. Hmm. Nada. Neither. That's too bad. Well, let's get some weapon parts. We're going on, we're going into our over 650 four star pulls now. Yeah, and then we'll do five star characters to fix. So Aerith, Vincent, Lucia, and Sephiroth today. I don't have any Sephiroth stuff, okay. Oh I have this two of these. We don't want to use those. Six hundred over over six hundred. Did I say six hundred fifty? I meant over five hundred fifty. We have six hundred thirteen four star gacha tickets to pull. Coming up right now. Let's go.
we're gonna see a lot of that. A lot of that. These ones don't like to give you five star stuff. We'll take those. Maybe we'll get lucky. Hopefully we get luckier on these than uh, we did with the regular dodge. Mm -hmm. More Vincent, let's go. Okay, okay. Just don't be sheer on. Anything but sheer on. It's sheer on oh, of all the Vincent weapons. It's got to be the one that's already OB10. Shell knuckles, we'll take them. We'll take them. These are gonna be great, man. These four star tickets. I feel like in smaller amounts, when you only have like 10 or 20 of them, it's like, ah, oh, man, this isn't gonna give me anything, you know? Because they like rarely give you five star weapons. But like in a mass amount like this, it's gonna be great, dude. It's gonna give me so many weapon parts. I'm gonna have so many things silver boost that I'm not even realizing I'm getting right now. Like, there's probably so many weapons just sitting at like 150 weapon parts, 180, that are gonna be over 200 now. Ooh, the rose muskets I could use, I forgot about those. I need two more. Mine's OB8. Five star. The newer attack weapon. Wayhander? Uh, mine's pretty low over boost. Mine's like OB2, I think. So That's OB3 now. Dark Heavens will be 10 plus 3, I think. Bunch of stuff I already have maxed out already. Like ha at least half of that was already think that it'll be done. When it comes to the four stars, I mean, I guess you could say this about any type of pull, but it's, it's uh, you really don't want anything that's already in the big ten. <laughs> We have here red. Okay, 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 okay. Is that junk or gold? Junk. Nice. I think mine's OB6, so now that's OB7. For frenzy fang. Magic attack down. Good to have. Shell knuckle parts, we want those. Let's go. Sawed off shotgun, we, we'll take those too.
Whoa, two. And one's a Vincent. Anything but Sheeran, anything but Sheeran. And give me the shark for uh, Barrett. Shark shooter. Shark shooter. Ice. Let's go, I like that. Okay, what a, what a beautiful pull. What a beautiful pull. Ice gun for Vincent. I like that pull. I'm very happy with that pull. We need more pulls like that. Give me stuff that I want. <laughs> That's like my third shark, right? At least. Third or fourth. But I didn't have a single copy at OB0 yet before this. They're adding up, though. They're adding up. We're getting them. A couple hundred. Went through a couple hundred of these so far. Those are nice to have. It's 107. I hit that cusp with the four stars. Nice. Got extra copy out of the uh, the part. Let's go. So that uh, Moogle float is OB three now. OB four. So it'll be zero when I got three more copies. OB3, I mean. We'll take the tranquilizer guns. We don't have any. I think it's our abilities are kind of good, right? Healing and ability potency. Because you have a healer that's also attacking, whether it's physical or magic, that'll be good to have. We'll take it. Not that most. Most healers aren't attacking too, but I wish that was silver. Wish that was silver. Or ivy. More shark pieces. Where are we at with these? 170. I got OB0. Oh, it's only at OB1? Really? I feel like I got so many more of those. Maybe it was just like parts that we were getting and I was remembering it as if it was a whole new one. Whole new five star copy. Hmm. Unless the game's stealing from me. I'm just kidding. Maybe we'll get enough parts out of Hawkeyes to get another one of those, too. I feel like I've seen a few. Let's get a bunch of those. Cloud, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Yes, we'll take that. Mine's only OB6 or 7 right now, so that's... Now it's either OB7 or OB8. We will take it. With the Blazing Strike. England. Let's see, a centipede or a syringe rapier, and a slay the day. Axis and a slay the day! Hey, That's OB9 now. I guessed it. I nailed it. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Barrett and Sephiroth. Shirt and... Nameless? Or is that Shinra Military? Nameless. Oh, that's OB7 now. Micro Laser. Oh wait, I have 400 parts for it? That's weird. It's OB8 then. Ah, 
we'll take that. That brings magic defense up all. I think mine's already at OB6. Core Defender. But, so it's OB7 or OB8 now. Not including all the extra perks we get. Is this my final Slay the Day right here? Or is it another Rest in Peace? Or, or piece of cake? I don't want that even. It's a piece of cake. <laughs> Too many piece of, pieces of cakes. Too many of those. <laughs> also for bed. Good luck, buddy. Thank you, homie. Thank you. Hope you have a good night, Faded. Thanks for stopping by hanging out. Crazy how long it's taken, that's for sure. Two over two hours into the stream. Still got a bunch to go. Still gotta do all the character specific five stars and then all the actual five stars. Sephiroth, Sephiroth, Aerith. I don't even know what I need out of Sephiroth anymore. I like I like have everything. To be fair, I don't have Gla I don't have Glary that uh that's OB6 now for Glary. Does Shinra Military? That's at OB7, that's good to get. And this is OB10 plus now. Not bad, that was, that was a pretty good pull. That's OB10 plus. That's okay. We expect those, you know? Only over 300 more of these. Zack and Cloud. Zweihander and Hard Edge. Don't really need either of them. Can't really get much good cloud stuff except for the fire sword. Like with the one that does blazing strike. Take those. I don't need any more hard edge. That's max now. Tifa, let's see um the lightning AoE gloves. The pink ones. Sonic Strikers, so I'll take him. That's uh, now OB7, I think. We did get 10 parts for the uh, pink lightning ones there. Silver, 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 silver. Ah, oh, man. Come on, get get at least one one silver collar in all these pulls. At least. At least one. More rest in peace. You're trying to tell me. You're trying to tell me something here. It's like, yo, go with school. You gotta go rest in peace, bro. <laughs> go kill yourself. Boo. What are you doing? Nah, it, it's not telling me that. I'm too deep into this. I'm too deep. Ooh, almost, uh, if I get one more 10 parts for S19, I have another copy. Which would be at OB7. That'd be nice. That's something I want to get at OB10. It's a good weapon to have there. Twin Viper.
see uh, S19 copy. Quicksilver. Oh. Got a bunch of these. Crystal gloves. Two more um, 10 parts of shell knuckles and we have another copy. Saber. Magic attack cloud. When will that ever happen? Maybe soon. Maybe his new Bahamut outfit that he's getting is magic. Maybe. Yeah, that it'll be ten. Thank you. Thank you for the follow, Ova. I appreciate you, bro. Hope this is a centipede or a syringe rape here. Centipede, preferably. I got. That's like my third or fourth axis. Which is alright, because I, I didn't even have it at OB6 yet, but... Could be better. Could be better. Could be worse, too, though. Could be getting more Killer Hornets, which is already OB10. Which I happened once already. Come on, Centipede. 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 Uh, we'll take that. It's got magic uh, ability, stance, potency, and magic defense. It's got some good R abilities. We might both use that. We really need auto overboost up for weapons. Yeah, when, for situations like this, right? Holy. Do them all for me. That'd be nice. <clears throat> I already have Marisame OB10. We'll take it, though. I guess. <laughs> I suppose. So you must uh, overboost a bunch of weapons yourself, huh? Uh, how'd your guild do in the in the last guild battles? If you even do guild battles. Man, guild battles are so fun, man. I love all the ranked events. 230 something? Okay. Okay. Okay, top 500. Top 300. Just a casual guild. Fair enough. Fair enough. I see a lot of that. I see, like, really good players on YouTube and stuff. And their guild is, like, either it's just them by themselves or, like, them and five people. And hey, it is what it is. The guild isn't for anyone. Everybody. So what... I really hope they bring back, like, individual ranked stuff. Like, ranked dungeons were so much fun. I feel like dungeons are so easy for whales now, but they could make more difficult, harder routes. Like, how there was always the more difficult side boss, right? They could have, add, like, a third optional boss, which is intense or something. I don't know. It, it... They gotta do something. They gotta do something for the solo people. I didn't really like the battle... Like the m customize your battle ranks in between uh, the rank dungeon and the guild. That wasn't as fun. But they gotta bring solo rank stuff back for sure. Tempest. We, we could use that. That's OB7 now. Yeah, the customized battle one's just... It's so tedious. The dungeons were way more fun. 
I do not need holiday gloves. That's OB10 plus plus something. Kate Sith, Aerith, Zach. This is a good one, hopefully. Let's see Crystal uh, Megaphone or Flower Vase. Is that Crystal or is it Silver? Don't be Silver. It's Crystal, let's go! That's OB6 now. This is OB10 now, it was OB9 beforehand. And this is uh, OB10 plus plus. I want the ability to reroll stats on materials, yo. Yeah, some of my guildmates and I were uh, talking about the same thing not long ago. That would be nice. So like a lot of us are just holding on to like five star materials that suck, because you never know. Or and to add stats, like maybe add elemental damage up earth. Mm, that's interesting. Proposition. Oh, Apocalypse. We don't have many of those. And more of the physical attack ice one. Okay. How many have been pulling of these? Yeah, like for like a quick era blow, it's at 300%, you know. Another interesting thing would be uh, maybe combine two materials of the same rarity. And when you do, or like you, or you, um, you have a host one and one that you push into another, and you can't just give it all the other stats. That doesn't. It shouldn't work like that, because there's more than four stats, right? But maybe it randomly takes two of the stats that the other one already has, and just like does something, you know, so, something like something with the combining materia. I don't know. <laughs> It's interesting to think about what they could do with this game, like all the stuff that's still to come, right? Like, we saw it's a, it, it's official on their YouTube and Twitter now for like that they're adding like um, weapon attachments and like like all, the ultimate weapon being like a third weapon slot or something, which is weird, but like cool at the same time. And now everybody's weapons are going to be different because people can customize, not customize, but that's will be ten plus. But we can like. Make specific our favorite we specific weapons stronger in different ways, like our, the stats of them and shit. It's gonna be crazy, man. The stuff that they're doing this, to this game, it's happening really fast. You know, there's, they're adding so much to this game so quick. It's hard to keep up with. You can almost like not even play another game if you want to keep up with everything. Prototype Crimson, I already have enough of. My big fear about ultimate weapons is that they will be banners. I think they will be, bro. I think they will be. That's probably the case. Which which does stink. Oh no. I don't know for sure, but like if I was to guess, I, I would assume. We got more electro cannon, let's go. I don't need the boomerang, so I already have enough of those. You know what? Maybe the new Bahamut outfit for all the characters that are coming out for the, like uh, the new anniversary banners. They they gotta be getting ultimate weapons, right? Like I don't know why I'm confused right now. Oh, I know I'm confused because I was talking about it earlier, and like I think they're gonna be uh, limit break weapons, right? I don't know how they're going to implement the uh, ultimate weapons yet. I'm still kind of confused on how they'll work. I have, a, I have a general idea, but it's like, really? They're going to do that? You know? Strange. Oh, this is like OB9 now. We'll see with the whole ultimate weapons, man. I'm not, I'm not a good source for uh, knowledge on that. <laughs> I take a look at the data mines, I take a look at the leaks, you know, but, uh, I, I still don't know. Uh, 
This is insane how many pulls I've already done. I've been pulling for over two hours. And we still got a bunch to go. You're here just in time for the hype stuff. As soon as these four stars finish it, we're going into the five stars. Matt. Absolute Royale. I actually don't need Absolute Royale at all. I don't know why I got excited. Where the Crystal Megaphone's at? Two more of those so far. That's not bad. I'll take those. Yeah. I already have that at OB10. Her HP lightning. Uh, our ability weapon. Bro, 370? I need 30 more of these parts to OB-10 it. Come on. Come on. Okay, here we go. Moving on to the five stars. We're doing character specifics first, and then I've got 81 of the, 82 of these. Okay, character specifics except for Sephiroth, Vincent, Aerith, Lucia. No Sephiroth, no Lucia. Let's do Glens. Six Glen draws. Here we go. Let's see at least just one slay the day. Just one. Mine sitting at OB9. I got a budget with Anniversary Cop. Let's see if you can buy any packs. I feel that, bro. Don't listen to me. I'm a whale. But, uh... I'm going hard. <laughs> I'm going hard and then I'm gonna chill out for a few months and just like low spend, you know? Oh, centipede! Wait, what the fuck? Oh, this was um Matt, Glenn, and Lucia. I probably should have waited on this for uh, Lucia's new weapon. That's okay. Serpent Eater, that's at OB9 now. Jiggy Fam is OB8 now. That's close to OB10. This is getting up there. I'm happy with the centipede though. It was worth it. Yeah, I'm gonna go super hard both the next couple my next couple paychecks on the anniversary banner and then I'm gonna chill out and probably have an and probably build up enough blue crystals to get like a Halloween costume or both you know I'll probably still get the Halloween like go up to Halloween costumes but that's it because those won't be, won't be limited by that point but let me see here Zach's speaking full on nine Zach's Ooh, that looks so nice. <laughs> looks beautiful. I'd take a screenshot. I didn't have. Oh yeah, I didn't have pressure ridge. Crazy. Let's go. I did not have pressure ridge. Two ceremonial swords, the fire, type ninety nine. That was a great pull. I didn't get anything over OB10, except this might have just hit OB10, which is nice. I'll take that. Except for Black Whiskers is OB10 plus already. But other than that, 
everything else is going in to good use. Let's go. That was a great, beautiful fucking Zack pull. I should have screenshotted what I got there. Um, all right. So no Lucia, no Sephiroth, no Vincent, no Aerith. We're saving those for when the next weapons hit the pool. Just one for Kate Seth. Get a flower vase, a crystal, or a green megaphone. Those are the three I'll be satisfied with. Anything but those three will not be satisfied with. Flower vase! Let's go! <laughs> hey. I'm stoked on that. Okay. Lucia, Sephiroth, Vincent. Yuffie is safe to pull on. Let's go. Let's see some Moogle floats. Some uh, fire Moogle floats. Moogle float. That one we don't need. Uh oh, twin viper. Let's go, dude. This is a. This was a beautiful pull. This was a beautiful pull. Everything I got here went to good use except for the wind slash. I already have it at Ob10, and uh, this is already Ob10 plus as well. Razor ring. But that's okay. Four of the six things. Fuck yeah. So happy I'm still streaming, and you get to see a little bit before bed. What's up, Grieve? Coming through. I still stream sometimes. Beautiful pull. Beautiful pull, bro. Beautiful pull. I've been saving most of these tickets since fucking uh, November last year. November last year, bro. Here we go. Three. We want to see at least one Ivy or Silver Color here. Preferably Silver. Let's go. Only three, but they're all guaranteed gold. Saving money. That's what's up, bro. Saving money. <laughs> uh, seaside. Junk. Oh, that's gold. I can never tell the difference between junk collar and gold collar. Canyon collar. That's good to get. I forgot about that one. Now we'll take the we'll take the canyon collar. I'm happy with that. I need like two more copies of that. One more copy now. So. Uh, what else are we saving? We're saving Lucia, Sephiroth, Vincent, Aerith. Everything above Aerith we can pull here now. Pull in Tifa. We've got 11 gold tickets. Guaranteed 10 from Tifa. This is a beautiful sight. What a beautiful sight. How often do you get to see this? Never. What I want to see out of these ones... I want to see her pink... Her pink uh, AOE lightning gloves. Can't think of the name right now. Crystal gloves. I always Two of them! And shell, and shell knuckles. Let's go, dude! This is OB10 now. We got the last copy of feather gloves. Dude, what a great pull! What a beautiful pull. Leather... I don't have, like, any leather gloves. Everything except for the Grand Gloves on the bottom there. It's good. The only re again, Grand Gloves are great. The only reason I'm not satisfied, not cool with those is because I already have all the ones I need. But uh, that was amazing. OB10. <laughs> Overboosted 10. Like the Overboosted Max. <laughs> yeah, bro. OB10. Let's go. And one more for the sake of it. Is that 11? We don't want that shit. That shit's garbage. <laughs> All right. Every, uh, we're saving Lucia, Sephiroth, Vincent, and Aerith for another month for now. Everything above that can be pulled. 
One bear. Here we go. Solid bazooka, I don't... Ah, uh, it's good, but... You know what? I'll take it. I think mine was OB6, so it's OB7 now. I was given that hesitant, uh... <sighs> I was a little hesitant on that because I thought it was OB10. But no, we're good. We're good. We'll take those. The only thing I could really get from Cloud that I'm down with is his fire sword. If we get at least one of them, that's cool. Oh yeah, and Apocalypse is alright too. Uh, both of these are alright, actually. I don't know why I forgot about both of these. But, uh, no, I'll take both of those. No Fire Sword, though. F7 and... Gosh! <laughs> that startled the shit out of me. Uh... <laughs> Uh, I gotta check here if any character era Vincent we're not gonna pull this one yet we're gonna wait we're gonna wait on those all right here we go lucky 82 <laughs> I've been pretty lucky 82 of these here we go this is gonna be nuts Most of these were purchased, like, oh, since November last year. Most of them. The game is nice and gives you, like, one sometimes for free here and there. But I have 82 of them. Lots of Kate Sith. I hope we get Crystal Megaphone or Flower Vase or Green Megaphone from Kate Sith. Hope we get Centipede from Matt. Let's see what we get. Out of, out of those things. I got a centipede from Matt. That's a centipede. Heck yeah. None of the Kate Sith stuff. That's okay though. Can I? Oh, well, that's fine. That's a good pull actually. A lot of good weapons in there. From the other people too. A lot of good stuff. See what we get. Uh, this one not so, this one not so much. Not even close to as good as the last one. Except I do really need these. These are on the wish list. Marine shooter, great. Everything else, meh. Some of the things are good, but they're only met because I already have Meadow B10. Nothing from Vincent, man. We need more Vincent stuff. Surveys! And Crystal Gloves! Bro! What a great pull. Is that Silver Collar? Tell me that Silver Collar. Rubber Collar! Oh, I can never tell the difference with red weapons. Rubber Collar is gross. We don't want that. We want Silver. I want to see at least one silver color. That'd be so nice. All these gold pulls are insane. That's not silver. It's not shiny enough. Platinum. Is this crystal? Ah, silver. Megaphone. Silver megaphone. We want silver collar for red. We want crystal megaphone for case it. Never know when you're going to need it. Nothing wrong with having rubber on deck, bro. <laughs> it's a good point. Stay clean out here. We, uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> I 
I don't even know what else to say to that one. Kate Seth. Never know when you're gonna need a rubber. Yo, shell knuckles and sharks. We're getting the sharks. Is that marine over here too? No, that's black rifle. Oh, that's mad minute. John. Bro. Why am I getting so many silver megaphones? Give me crystal ones. Anyways, other than that, all the shark slayers, shell knuckles, let's go, dude. That was a good one too. I should have screenshotted that one. You excited for the free gear selector? Yo, me too, Oza. I'm gonna get a uh, Barrett's Electro armor with it for sure. That's what I missed. That's just overall good for any situation. Um, if this is silver, I'm happy with it. It's sleek. Uh, this this was the worst um, one yet. Only reason is because like most of these things, I already have it. Ob10. That was the worst one. What are we getting from Kate Seth? Anything good? Be crystal. It looks like it's silver, I think. So many silvers, I want crystal. Pinwheel's good, I'm happy with that. And uh, crystal gloves. Yes, we have that at OB10 now. Twink Twink Star. This was actually a good pull. This was actually a good pull. We'll take that with the micro laser. We'll take that. Damn, Vincent looks so sick. <laughs> Yo, Vincent is dope, bro. He's like the coolest new character. And unless you're spending money on the game, most people's Vincents are kind of bad right now because his weapons just got added to the pools, right? Whereas everybody else's have like almost a year of work done on them. But you know I spent money. One of my Vincents, my Vincent is one of the best out there right now. You're gonna have a nice time over boosting these weapons. I'm gonna be doing it right on stream, right after this. I'm doing that. It's gonna take a while, but I'm doing it. Ooh, Rose Musket. Let's go. Is this silver? Platinum again. Oh, I didn't get a single silver collar. <laughs> that one that one wasn't bad either. Only two more. Shark Slayer, Shark Slayer, and a floral wand. Micro laser and a fairy tale. That's fine, the micro laser is good. <clears throat> Anyways, thanks everybody for being here. If you're still around, I appreciate you. If you're not still around, I still appreciate you. Take care, guys. Have a good night.